Allegedly, we're on. Allegedly. I like that. Allegedly, we're here. Hello. Let's see if it shows up. Hello, everybody. We are live. It just showed up live. How cool is that? Um... Okay, beautiful. I have to do a couple things. Roman's going to be talking. I'm talking, talking. You're talking, talking. I'm not really saying much of anything. Other than we're having one hell of a windstorm here today. So you I actually... M- you might hear it on our mics, <laughs> actually. Um, I had to set it up with a, a generator. I set it up. Um, we have a, a little solar generator. And um, I've got it set up in there just in case we lose power. It's unlikely, but you never know. Ever the Boy Scout. I love that yes. about you, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just checking to see. Um, yeah, okay. uh, you should be able to hear us okay. Mm-hmm. That should okay. look quite nice. And then I go to gypsysoul.com. So I know that many of you know where to watch or you have your comfortable places where you like to watch. Um, but you can watch it on Facebook. You can watch it on our website. Which is basically so Twitch. Gypsy Soul. That's, that's the Twitches. Oh, that's so cool! It now the your our our little profile picture says live. They didn't do that before. That's pretty groovy. Oh, okay, that's so very let me nice. go here and edit, and then I add my little paragraph. Thank you for your patience. Ah, so birthday girl. Yeah, it's been a super fun day. Everybody's like, "Are you playing the songs from those records that you posted?" And I said, "No, <laughs> no. that was just our good morning." That was morning. Wonderful. Morning music. Yummy music. Yeah. It was so fun. Uh, um, well, I'm, while you're saying that, okay, I'm going to say thank you to a couple of people. Um, Lisa and Gary, thank you for your donation. Yes. Jan and Dave, of course, thank you. And then we've got... Uh, Maggie and Eric, Maggie Gina and, and Eric, Paul. Gina and Paul, Ramona Kearns, thank you very much. Oh, thank you, Ramona. Um, and thank you for that other Vicky surprise Harvey. donation that you gave us... Um, a couple months back, I didn't know how to get in touch with you because it didn't have your email or your address. So I'm glad that you donated again, and thank you so much for that. Really well, thank you, Cheryl Walters, as well. Okay. Very nice. Oh, hi, Cheryl, our neighbor. Oh, is that right? Yeah. <laughs> One of our neighbors. Aww. Oh, hello, Cheryl. Yes. How cool is <laughs> very that? Nice. Thank very you. Sweet. Cheryl made me actually when I was six. She made me an amazing curry. Yes. Um, it was a Thai curry that was absolutely delicious. And Christ- she Christmas. made a chocolate peppermint cake. Oh, yes. Because it was Christmas. That was so cute. It was very sweet. We never forget stuff like that. Really quite extraordinary. So thank you very much. Are we live okay, everywhere? Okay, I think we're we live everywhere. I can okay. see. I'm going to put my phone down. So happy that you guys can be with us on my birthday and all the March baby birthdays. So we don't really go by Aries because that would then take us into April. And April, we talk about the majority of the April people. So um, this is specifically uh, the March babies. And um, yes, it's so fun to actually perform on my birthday. Actually, both of us are performing on our birthday this year. Yes, we are. And it's my sister's birthday. And it's one of our dear friends in Montreal, Shelly Hall. You hear Shelly Hall from Montreal. Shelly Hall from Montreal. And thank you, Shelly Hall from Montreal. Right now, she contributed. That's very sweet. We're going to get this uh, show rolling with one of our uh, fun fave covers that uh, we think you will enjoy. So thank you so much for being with us. If you could do me a huge favor and share this live stream, we call it life stream, life affirming stream. If you can share it on your social media pages, that would be extraordinary because it just helps us reach uh, near and far. So thank you so much. And also, um, those who, uh, actually it's Jan and Dave, I'm stumbling for words. That's because I'm so old. Um, <laughs> Jan and Dave, text me and let me know how the sound, the sound is. Do or Maggie and Eric. Do you have your phone? Or my my phone, phone is right here. Okay, so, so Roman's phone is It's not going to beep or anything, but uh, you can let okay. me know if it's okay. Speaking of which, I'm going to take my volume We good? Silent mode on. Is that what I want? Yes. Okay. Good.
So let us know how the sound is. I'm going to thank you. Welcome some people here. Oh, Dave, our neighbor. It was our pleasure. Our pleasure. Uh, okay. Yeah. Let's see. Tough couple of days. Yeah. Very dear neighbor of ours passed away two days ago, and uh, it was sudden and shocking. And so the whole neighborhood's reeling. Um, okay. Let me see here. So we've got Kim Muck. Sound is great. Natalie Swan, beautiful. Sound is really good. Thank you. And Gina Brown. Aww. Hello, Gina Brown. Happy birthday. And Downtown Gina you, Brown. Thank you so much for that very generous donation last time. And yes, Daniel Scalaro is watching. Very nice. Aw. So cute. Okay. And so, thank you, Dave. Yes. Glad Dave, that the sound Dave is just good. Dave just told me yes. Okay, good. Good. Our golden, <laughs> our ears. Our golden ears. Golden ears. Okay, so this is one of our songs. It's called I'm Calling In. <laughs> It's about listening to that very quiet voice sometimes that we override, we don't want to hear, because we know that our conscience knows uh, what direction to go 99% of the time. So this is I'm calling in. Doing something different with us. We'll see if that works. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thank you. 
it's too crude that we were here, share our fears, shed some tears. Oh, and faithful friends who never need to ask the reasons why. Go to number four, and then we'll do okay. that one. I recently met some folks from Prescott who remember you two. Oh, nice. John Flynn, happy birthday. Thank you so much. Hi, Daniel. Jacqueline is here. Oh, so nice. Do you know a girl from Bainbridge Island? I think it's Amanda Ray. Rye, W-R-A-Y. She may be moving here. Um, she was in school, I think, after me. And then Jan, very nice, Bob Blackburn. Aw, thank you. Dwindy, thank you so much. Jan, Natalie, lovely. Okay, Jim Botts and Sherry Vansicle. Aw, so sweet, you guys. Okay, thank you, everybody, so much for your comments. Ooh. We so appreciate it. Do let us know where you're listening from and share it on your social media pages. And, um, and then, you know, if you have nothing this. else to do, why don't you let us know when you first discovered Gypsy Soul. If it was through the live streams or a friend dragged you to a show and you're like, oh my God, what's this band I'm going to be listening to? And then maybe you stuck around for a little while, which is the best kind of stories. Hi, Winnie. Happy birthday, Angel. Oh, you're so cute. Okay, darling. Okay, so we are going to go to... A song that we wrote for Malala Yousafzai, and it was and is International Women's Month. And we wrote this song because she's an absolute hero, an extraordinary human being, and an inspiration to so many people, including us. We were so taken with her story. So this is called You from Malala. Okay. 
as you can see, there's a, there's, <laughs> there's a lot going on here. Okay, is everything going? Yes, it is. All right. Okay. There you go. What CD is that on, babe? 
Uh, it's on Inspire, as well as... I got asked that the other day. Uh, ooh. What is that on? Uh, oh, um, The World is My Country. Oh, yes, The World is My Country. The World is, in fact, my country. Why is this? Oh, and not that people buy many CDs anymore. I mean, that no, was that the bulk of our income for many, many years. Um, but really live performing and the live streams are our income streams now, as well as the jewelry, all those good things. But um, we do have thumb drives. And so a lot of people don't even have CDs in their cars anymore. We don't. And that's where we always listen to music until our wonderful friend Gavin, I don't know if you can see this in the picture, he bought us for our 30th wedding anniversary the coolest gift ever. It was a record player and 30 of our favorite artists. 30 fa of our favorite albums plus two speakers. Yes, plus two speakers. Uh, and then we bought the subwoofer because, you know, I'm a bass player. So. And then we've been collecting as we go along. We have. A lot of jazz, actually. Yeah, we've been getting a lot of jazz. But okay, anyway. One moment. One okay, moment. moment. Byron Muck. Okay, Byron. Thank you, Muckies, Muckies. Uh, thank you very much, Gina Brown. Thank you again for yours. And who do we have here? Linda Kerner. Thank you very much, Linda. Thank you. And Bob Crickhouse. Oh, Babalu. I'll be seeing you tomorrow morning. Yes, Roman's going to... coffee. Roman's going to see and his... Uh, croissant. League, oui. League of Extraordinary Gentle very, Man. Singular, singular tomorrow. Singular man tomorrow. So people are sharing where they've met us, which is really fun. I always love this part. I still love physical CDs. Well, thank God for you, Eric Foxbog. Yes. Um, sounds we amazing. Love you Vocals as are well. perfect, and Roman's guitar sounds good. Thank you very much, Terry. Um, for some reasons, my contacts are not working, so I can barely read this. And if I'm squinting, forgive me. Uh, Sherry Vansicle. Okay, so we saw you at an outdoor art show in early 2000, unusually hot summer day in Seattle at Sand Point. You had your white tent to shelter you as you performed under the sweltering sun. Oh, was this, uh, uh, where was that? Very good memory. What did you say? That was in Seattle. No, no, but where was it um, specifically? Seattle. Right, uh, really Sand Point. Sand Point? Yeah, weird, huh? I don't no. remember that at all. Okay, so, and then Monica Hollins. <gasps> Hello Monica. from Texas. If you guys from are Texas, there still, I didn't hi, know Marley. You moved to Texas. Preach it, sister, I love it. Okay, and Brian Eckfeld, that um, wonderful. Washington as well. I'm going to put some headphones okay. on now. And Melanie, thank you for being with us. And Cheryl, Boy, that does watching good. from Weaverville, California. First time we heard you was at a barbecue cook-off in Sparks, Nevada. Oh my gosh, that was a long time ago. We were mesmerized and have followed you since. You both are amazing and talented. Thank you so, so much. We almost didn't do that show because we were given the wrong directions. Oh, my God. And we went through, what's that part of? We went through Lassen Park. Lassen Park, and it took us And like it took us an extra, extra hours. three hours because you can only go like 15 miles an hour through. Somebody said, well, actually what they meant was it's really beautiful. It's pretty. But they didn't say... It's really beautiful, but don't take that route if you're in a hurry. Or you're they on They didn't tour say that, or if you're, you're on tour. And then we got to the show. I almost came to blows. And the presenter was like, no, sorry. Um, and we, we were there like the day before. He's like, no, you're late for setup. You can't play. And it was a five-day show. And we're like, that's just not going to work for us, so we need to come to some kind of agreement here. There was definitely a bit of this and, going and on. And we ended, and, and yeah, we ended up chatting. So that had to pull me away. Yeah, there's times where sometimes I negotiate <laughs> Anyway. I negotiate in different in a different way. You do sometimes in a in a kind of Roman. It's a more way. masculine way. And and I negotiate in a slightly softer, you different do. way. And we and both use our different wiles when we need them. We do, especially like if there's a super cute girl up at the counter at the hotel. I'll send Roman up there. <laughs> Go ask for an upgrade, babe. Use your British charm, babe. You know you got to use what you have. And yeah, you, you do. And in, it, it and, is in, true. and in last uh, three years ago when we were house hunting. In Prescott, we stayed at the resort, and we found it, whatever, on Hotwire or something. And we arrive, and I asked the receptionist if she could recommend a good restaurant because it was my birthday, and we were meeting some friends. And, and we she, actually weren't being cheeky. We were just saying, no, we I remember a her nice name. restaurant. Her name was Crystal. Crystal she was so cute. Right. I don't know if she's still there, but I was so touched. And she said, oh, it's your birthday. We're giving you an upgrade. And they gave us, Today like, is your birthday. the presidential <laughs> suite or something. <laughs> we had the killer view. 180-degree view. It was so it extraordinary. And a really nice walls. gift for my birthday. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Wynn Win just said, love that song. Met you first, 4th of July. Is it possible to lower your mic so we can see your face? Oh, well, thank you. That's very kind. <laughs> <laughs>
Don't make me do my Muttley laugh, okay? <laughs> I love you. That's very kind, my friend Wynn. Okay, so we're doing... Um, we're doing um, Soil of a... Yes, <laughs> um, did I doing, say that? Do, do, did you say that on the thing? And sometimes Roman writes really funny words for our lyrics. Just to see if I can solicit a chuckle. Which um, you which did I write did. a little funny word there. So we're going to do our I did. birthday. So for all of our March babies, we'll talk about you guys shortly. I've got a little list. And if I have missed and anyone, she's checking it to us. please forgive me. I always ask that you write to me because I can't always find people's birthdays after the fact on Facebook. I wish there were an easy way to do that. And if you know of an easy way, please let me know. Because I do not. So um, these are the ones that I happen to catch. We have to do this one. Hmm? Well, we, are, well we, we'll do a happy birthday in a bit. Oh, not before this one? No. Okay, that's fine. Okay. No, that's fine, that's fine. It usually flows so well into this song, but we'll save it. Oh, sure, why not? Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to, to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, baby. Even Boo Boo's coming. Happy birthday.
Sounds delicious, I have oh, to good. say. Oh, good. I'm so glad, honey. Okay, We so changed her mic. Yes, we did change oh. mic. <laughs> She puts her mic down. As I put my mic we down. We did. Um, we were... You know, you just... You always have to kind of upgrade and try different things, and um, especially with live streaming, because it's a very different thing than performing in person. So here you go. Let's see. Um, Aries, oh Aries women rule. Oh, I love it. Never tire of that song. Thank you, Winnie. <laughs> Ooh, listen uh, to that wind. I love you guys. Ten years now. Come back to the Bay Area, please. We well, are. That brings us to our touring. So in September, I think we're going to call the tour that um, 60 is the new 40. And because it's going to be Roman. No, it's not. Very big, splashy, fabulous Ooh. birthday. I refuse to have that birthday. Well, it's going to be your 40th birthday. No, on no, your it's my 30th for the second time. <laughs> it's the 30th anniversary of my 30th birthday. Yes, exactly. Shit. Dan Prince, we first met you at the Unity Fair at Jackson Hot Springs. Oh, my God, 22 years ago. Have loved you ever since. Happy and blessed birthday to you. Very kind. 1999 Galaxy Theater, Santa Ana, oh Eric. Oh, my God. Eric Foxfog. Hi, Jessica. Really? You're on our birthday list. Happy birthday, honey. Aaron Hersey, we saw you at Kulon Beach <laughs> at Lake Washington. Oh. Not sure which year. Then the Christmas shows at the Triple Door. We miss you up here in Seattle. Okay. So on that September tour we're talking about, we Roman and I so. are going to be um, hitting up Southern California, Northern California, Oregon on his birthday, September 7th. I believe that's kind of the first big show. And then we go up to Washington, and we have three shows in Washington, and one of them I just cannot wait. Um, in fact, all of them. I love the thought of all of them. But one of them specifically, because I grew up on Bainbridge Island. So on Friday the 13th of all days, we are playing at the... Um, the shoreline. Is it the shoreline? The movie theater. Or We're playing at the movie theater where I used to go watch movies for a dollar. That'll age me a little bit, date me. Um, and like, you know, they would let us sneak into R-rated movies and stuff. We were way too young. Anyway, but it's now a musical. Those hall. were the good old days. I got into a whole <laughs> bunch of, of R-rated movies. I saw Alien and it scared the shit oh, out yeah. of me. We it saw Jaws. Really did. It, <laughs> it was, was never the same after Jaws. I can see why they actually had ratings. For I see it now. <laughs> it's just, it's just and now. then my brothers and sisters would sneak me into stuff. There was no way I should be seeing that. Um, Exorcist. Exorcist. Yeah, I wasn't. That's not a good Carrie, one. Carrie, and then um, Kentucky Fried Movies, which was quite horrible. Oh my God! Okay, I was I got like, a few more. I was Hang way on. too young. Way too young. Arlene Davis, thank you. Thank you, Arlene. And oh, who's this? William Meyer, thank you very much. Lovely, you your, guys. And uh, Larry, Aww. we're thinking of you today, mate. Yes, we are. We Larry. really are. Oh, my goodness. What a time. It so is a time. thank you so, so much, you guys, for the support. This is what keeps us going. This is our career. You know, we do, we're going to be doing the touring probably once a year where we leave for three or four weeks because it's just too hard to leave our cats. And, and we're already. Speaking of which, hello, boo boo girl. Hi, hello, boo -boo. little sweet hi, pea. Are you going to come over? Come say hi. Anyway, but that's why it's really hard to tour. So we can do things within Don't about wait. a five or six mi um, five or six hour radius of home um, regularly, 
you know, like New Mexico, parts Which of Utah. Which brings me to a, actually a very, very interesting point. Really? How it, interesting it, is it that? Is very Would you share it with the audience? Um, MIM. Oh, yes. We're playing at MIM on May the 11th, and the tickets go on sale. Actually, if you're a member there, then the tickets are on sale right now. Um, but the tickets for the general public go on April 4th, 10 o'clock in the morning. Get online at 10 o'clock in the morning. I imagine yeah. they're going to be selling quite a few to the um, to the members, actually, because that's get, what usually yeah. happens. Yeah, I think they're going to sell about a third to half to the members. And then... Um, Yes, April 4th at 10 a.m. sharp, the tickets go on sale. Hello. We've sold it out six or seven times. The only time we didn't sell it out, it was a Sunday. And they had two events back to back, and it was kind of a weird booking. Well, they've um, got two more. Uh, did you notice? No. They've got like two things during the day before us. Oh, my goodness. I don't know how they, they do it. They pack it in that place. Anyway, it's one of the nice premier listening just. venues in the country. Hi, Eddie Griswold. And if I can't... Um, read your names perfectly i apologize michelle uh jones i can see that part hi marley again beautiful to have you guys with us and i know there's people on twitch and i know there's people on youtube and i have only so many fingers and microphones and um idaho watching from moscow idaho very nice diplomacy by other means <laughs> daniel you've always got good ones i think you and roman are very aligned um, best version of Day Tripper I have ever heard. Thank oh. you so much. Sound quality is excellent. Running through our Thank home you. theater. Oh my goodness. Oh. Those are the scary things because then the you're like, oh my god, I need a, Don't I need a facial. <laughs> I need a facial before we're on. I tell you ginormous what, screens. Just all of a sudden, the past couple of years. Well, you know what it is. It's nature's way of, of um, I think keeping <laughs> keeping couples together. What are you Because your eyes, are nothing, honey. What exactly are you nothing saying? Nothing at all. Um, my eyesight was going, Should then all of a sudden I need God. to wear glasses when I'm shaving. And boy, <laughs> that's a shocker. And also call your wife in to go, did I do a good job? Did I miss, you know, I always used to look at older guys and they'd have hair sticking out here and go, it's like, how could you possibly miss that? Now I understand. Aw, mm. beautiful Tina Angati, <laughs> wonderful. James, uh, Linda Shepard, okay, wonderful. Rhea Davis, we're watching and loving. And Marla. Looking forward to seeing you guys at the MIM. That's so great. Thank you very, very much. Remember, it's Mother's Day Saturday. It's not the actual Mother's Day. <clears throat> this is a song we don't do that often. It's called Can't Go Home. Oh, by the way, are you going to show that little thing? I've done it like okay. three times while you've Fabulous. been nattering okay, good. on. Well, I'm nattering on. <laughs> well, that inspires future conversations. <laughs> You're so cheeky. So this is a song that we wrote when we had moved from Scotland to Canada, where I was born, because that was easiest to come back in after being in Europe for a while. And we were in Los Angeles, and we felt completely displaced. We didn't really feel like we fit in, and we wrote this song, Can't Go Home, because... That actually remains the same. We still feel that, feel that way in Los Angeles, <laughs> but we have found our home in Prescott. But really, now that we're here almost three years, we have to say Prescott, Prescott, like biscuit. Yeah, um, biscuit. That's kind of, yeah. Are they you know that you're a stranger. Food, young lady, is she eating? Wh she's food? eating. She's eating Bella's food. That's okay. That's as long as Bella's not, not eating, eating her, her food. food. <laughs> yes, we have very specific needs in this we, house. We, we do. have very needy children. Yes. We do. Fluffies. All right, here we go. So here you go. Reverb is on. I don't need kick pedal, and I don't need... Yes. Oh, there's the wind. Hello, young lady. You're going to come over and say hello? No. no she's going to look for something to break. She's busy. All right, here we go. <laughs> Another thing I forgot. 
Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Just can't go home. 
So I've been programming my pedals. I actually got rid of a, my POG. Um, I realized actually I was only using it for one sound and the other sounds were all kind of the same. And then I got this um, Ocean's Eleven reverb from Electro. I love Electro Harmonic stuff actually. And I didn't realize it had a whole bunch of other effects in it. So I've been playing with that. That's amazing and then I've got this other thing that I replaced the pog with it's kind of a chorus pedal and he so yes so many fun toys well you know what it's just trying to keep it fresh um, and just realizing after a while you know you, you end up using the same things all over you know, <laughs> everything and I was like you know what and I programmed my, my I've got a big sky which is a for those of you who are guitarists it's an amazing amazing delay and reverb pedal and I was programming that as well and it's got some just delicious sounds in it. Anyway. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna start reading some birthdays. Happy um, birthday to Okay, me. so we've got uh, Shelly um, Hall today as well Montreal. as my sister Stacy today. And we've got Roselle, my sister in law was yesterday, so big birthday time for the family. Uh, Alan and Meredith both had birthdays recently. Yes, you did. And you're getting old. Of all people, Celine Dion and I are born on the same day, as is Eric Clapton, I believe. I've been told. I didn't double check. I should have, probably. Uh, Tim Langley had a birthday recently. Michelle Wolf Vincent will be seeing you at the Thumbnail Theater in uh, Washington. Mimi, uh, I think she's in Indiana now. Jessica's going to be having a birthday. Kim Shaw had a birthday. Kim Hornshaw. And Lorraine uh, Borden Cooper is going to be having a birthday. Gavin Derrick. Alicia in uh, Oregon. Bill Osborne, our neighbor, had a birthday. Claudia Hartman, another dear friend. Uh, in town, had a birthday, and then we have some anniversaries as well. That is very exciting. So the Ferudas are having a big anniversary tomorrow. The Clarks, they're in the Phoenix area. They're having an anniversary, and the Vigils had their anniversary recently. They're local folks. And some of the other people that had donated are the Clarks, Shelley Hall, Dia Wynn, the Ferudas, Gina and Paul, and uh, it's so wonderful. So thank you all so much for that. And then we also have some get well wishes, and we've had some passings since we last saw you. I want to uh, wish Christiana well, dear, dear friend from Oregon, uh, Lee in Washington, Winifred, um, some of the other recoveries, Lisa, Julie's doing really great, and um, Lisa in Petaluma, our hearts are with you honey and we know that you're going to do wonderfully well um same christiana and then we lost barb our dear neighbor across the street very suddenly and uh, as i said it's just put everybody into a state of shock nathan also wrote to us and asked to talk about his mom jan mckay and larry lost his mom harriet this morning so our hearts are with all of you and your families and we're sending you our very best and lots and lots of comfort and love and we also have a couple important shows coming up. Our next live stream is going to be uh, April 27th, or generally the last Saturday of the month, uh, unless it's during the holidays. And we do them kind of in the mid-month during the holidays, so we're not competing with the actual holiday. Uh, we've got Musical Instrument Museum on Mother's Day, Saturday, May 11th. We have our next live stream after that, which will be our memorial live stream. So if there's anyone that you want us to talk about on mic, please let us know well in advance. That's on the 25th of May. June 8th, we're going to be at the wonderful Highland Center, which is our kind of equivalent of a botanical gardens. And um, it's beautiful. It's really a wonderful place. Prescott is surround by a, surrounded by a million acres of Ponderosa Forest. And we're a mile high. So we've got really beautiful flora and allergies. fauna here. And lovely allergies for most everyone, except we found a really good solution. We so, did. Um, um, fabulous naturopath's office made a tincture it's the first thing that's worked for me. And I tell you, this, this year, everybody says it takes about three years for it to kick in <laughs> for the allergies. And I, <laughs> I had them the first <laughs> two. But this year was very, very bad. And I was like, honey, I I'm not sure I can do this. 
Mm -hmm. And she found me this um, selected. She We're staying, this, uh, so I had to find Roman a solution. A solution. And it's called Allergon, and they make it in-house. And it's a combination of it's Allergon amazing. and Sinutrol, and it works perfectly. And then our next uh, couple of live streams <coughs> after that, you can mark on your calendar, 629 and 727. And then, you know, we're doing some private shows and such in between. And then, as we mentioned, we're leaving on September, I think, 4th or something. And we'll be gone about three weeks. So we're going to get back to the music. I just want to say hello to a few people here. If I close my eyes, it feels like I'm seeing you. Oh, honey. Miss you. Miss you. Oh, my goodness. And thank you so much, Eric Fox Fox, for sharing our Venmo and for sharing our PayPal, because I can't, I can never remember those things online. And then Alaya, great, thank you for watching. And I have to thank everyone. Oh, John Float, very nice. Thank you guys for being with us. Tim Boggs, I'm sorry for squinting. Janet Laplante, happy birthday, friend. I've known Janet since we were all babies. Well, she was older than me, so I was a baby. Um, and then her youngest sister, I knew when she was a baby. So Literally it's just crazy. Uh, Baby, baby. We were baby babies. Thank you for this wonderful treat. It has been many, many years since I saw you perform at CSL in Seattle. That's Ken Olson. Well, we're going to be back in Seattle doing Thanks, three Winnie. different shows. David Hartman, so many lovely people. Don Howard, thank you for being with us. And um, I'd love to get to everybody, but we get to read your comments and stuff tomorrow. Uh, so thank you. Thank you very much for your support. You guys keep help us keep live music alive. That is for sure. So this is Natural Woman. I'm looking out on the morning rain. I used to feel so uninspired.
go. Oh, we're so happy you could be with us. Bum shot. And you chose to be with us tonight when you could be doing so many other things. Like it means the world to us, so thank you. What, cleaning your cat's teeth and things like that? You know, high priority things. Um, so we're gonna do a song. Oh, I see how this worked. Okay, we're gonna do a song called Time of Innocence. Roman and I wrote this on tour on our way to Prescott, not Prescott, maybe not that time. No, it was Arizona. We were, we were it was the first time we came to Arizona. We were going to Tempe, that's what it was. That was what we were doing, and it was, uh, we said this before, but when you come from California and you hit Arizona, it just changes. It's just like you go over the border yeah. and everything just looks different. Not least of all is there are no um, Advertisement. There are no like big. What are those called? Those the the big boards, advertisement boards. There are none of those in Arizona. Like you're coming out of California, you're just inundated with all of this advertising, and then you hit um, Arizona, and there's nothing, and everything looks different, and you start to see saguaros, and it smells saguaro, different, and it smells different. The air well, that is was, different. actually that was me. Oh. Well, maybe. Um, yeah. Okay. Because I ate something bad. Aww. Kim mm. Muck. It's the only concert in San Jose. Vicky Harvey. Oh, how cute that you know that. Okay. I don't remember the name of the theater. It's actually CSL San Jose. I just saw it on their schedule. I think it's... No, uh, Alameda. I don't know. It's in San Jose. Hi, Clayton. Hi, Jan. John. Very nice. Okay. And we've got Dennis with us. And then if I don't catch these comments, they kind of run away from me here. As always, wonderful, miss you. Happy birthday, happy Easter. Yes, happy Easter to so many people. Yes, And happy Carol Tinkstad as well is watching. Thank you, Diane. Diane, Diane. Tara Janelle, happy birthday, C Baby. That's my nickname with Tara. <laughs> Hi, cutie patootie. Oh, that was oh, very nice. Oh, and thank you Leslie, so much. Thank you very much, for Leslie. For all of the cards and the sweet <laughs> phone calls and the messages and the texts, <gasps> and I feel completely spoiled. There's all these really, really cute cards. Okay, I, I, you have to stop now because I've got to say some things. Okay, Dad. Michelle Davis, thank you very much. They are very, oh, I don't know where that one went. So, okay. Daniel Scalaro, thank you very much. It's very generous of you. Thank you. Nanette Salazar, thank you very much. That's very sweet. Cynthia, uh, well, I can't see. What's that? Maybe you need stronger glasses. I now. do need stronger. I, I, it's actually I have to. It's I have to wear these to play this, but in order to read, I need like telescopes. And, you know, Daniel made a good Shannon comment. Shannon as well. Thank you, Shannon Lacey. Thank you, Shannon Lacey. Dawn so glad. Howard so glad well. you're feeling better. Thank and you, Don. Thank you very much. But Daniel made a really interesting comment. He said you can sign up and be notified at least about the Bainbridge Island show on Bandcamp. Yes, and, you can. And that's a good place. Uh, probably the best place is GypsySoul.com/contact. Um, but all of these places are good to get notified. Well, no, actually, that is that's actually better. Because Not better than Gypsy Soul. Well, no, but for to get a reminder, you mm -hmm. sign up for a reminder, and they mm -hmm. will actually let you know. Yeah. Um, at band camp. At band camp. Yes. But a lot of people don't want to sign up for something new. So Gypsy Soul is really the best place to get Who kind of the most updated they releases. They should do what we say. Is that? They should do what we say. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's what I said. Sorry, I couldn't get a card out to you. Oh, Eric, please. You totally spoil us. That wine that you sent was so freaking good. The naked wines. Oh my goodness. I think the word is out that I like nice wine. Hi, Krista Townsend. Hi, Russell Matheson. Dwindy. All you cutie patooties. And Lisa and Gary also donated. I don't know if we had mentioned that before. We did. Um, thank but you we'll very, very much. we'll mention it again because you're incredibly Thank generous. you, everybody. And, and for those wonderful gifts as well. <laughs> That's quite something. Yeah, you guys I are got, out of control. I got completely spoiled today, so thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right. And then Roman's going to get something in a little bit for us to share in front of you. Yes. Yes, I am. I, yes. know. I know what okay. I'm getting. So... I think we might have to one the one is that you boo boo you squeaking no but you know what boo boo did she was sitting on the countertop until i looked at her she was waiting uh -huh. for one of us to notice because she's not allowed on the counter but this cat can jump six feet in the air like a helicopter no, she just is cray cray and she was just looking right at us like you can't do anything you're on camera right now you can't discipline me while you're singing do you remember doing that as a kid mm -hmm. na, 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 na. that's what our girls so do. childish 
but that's why I said that's what our girls kids. do. They're like, sup. They do yeah, with their sup. paws. Yeah, Mama, you can't discipline me right now. Okay, we're going on. This one's for you, Dave. I know it's your favorite. Dave and Jan, happy anniversary. Uh, Dave and Jan, happy anniversary. <laughs> Do you like that little vibrato there? That was one of those things I found on that pedal. I was like, oh my God, I didn't know I had a vibrato. He's in a huggy heaven. I am in, in a heaven with hogs. <laughs> you 
are fueled by the anger. Oh, you're driven by the dream, and I know it's been a long, been a long time. to well wish who are having some health struggles and uh, dear Celia she uh, she had a big fall and has had some subsequent pain issues and we just wish her well she's been coming over and laying on our beamer machine which is a PEMF machine that works in a very metaphysical mystical kind of way it works on your microcirculation but it does something else and it's what helped heal roman from his pulmonary and embolism months. and it's quite remarkable so we're hoping that that will help her uh and then shannon and also ali our dear friend ali so you've all been on our minds and in our prayers and we're just seeing you in pristine perfect health so that is our hope for you um, we're gonna do a song. This one's for Jan. This is Sandals in the Snow. Oh. Oh, did we, are we changing that? We are. Okay. We're doing that. Instead? Uh, yeah. Okay, it's gonna, actually, be a, it's gonna be an instead. So we'll do sandals. Tell me. We'll do sandals next time. We're gonna run out of time otherwise. Oh. Uh, this one is definitely for Lisa. This is for Lisa, and this song, I'm pointing to a book here by Julia Alvarez called In the Time of the Butterflies. And they can't see it. And they, they, can't, can they can't see it there. I know, I'm they pointing over here. It. Anyway, it's, an, it's a gorgeous book, and I highly recommend that you get it. I've recommended it to a number of friends, and they've loved it. Um, but this song came to me in a dream. But there were historical references that were accurate in my dream, and I didn't know the story of the Mirabal sisters from the Dominican Republic. And they are amazing, incredible heroes, and uh, risked life and limb, and in fact, most of them got... Is it two or three of them that got killed? I think four of them got killed by the regime. Do you remember by the, the regime. delivered... A, we, we yes, so we had to get a new dishwasher. A dishwasher broke. And this I young man, he was, he was kind of in his 30s, he was from the Dominican, Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic. And I asked him if he knew much about the Mirabal sisters, and he said, are you kidding me? He said, of course I do. Of course I do. <laughs> They're our national heroes. And there's apparently a Broadway play musical that they're doing about the Mirabal sisters. Like that, yeah. And there was a TV special. He's like, oh, so he wrote it down for me. It was so cute. But I don't think um, anyone who has crossed paths with him has asked him about the Mirabal sisters. So, so he, he gave us a whole bunch of free stuff. He gave us free stuff. He went back <laughs> to the really truck. Nice. He's like, he got you us need, a new um, you need this supply line and a new um, power cable for it. It was just like, oh, well, maybe they're Well, we talk to everybody who comes to the <laughs> house or nice. whatever. We like people, so we like hearing their stories. But it was pretty cute. He was so excited. So I think we gave him the CD and said, we think you'll like this song. Um, so this is Mirabelle. Amen. 
Like a faint melody played on the edge of angel wings And only you know why You chose me to share a story It's in the heart of the song that you sparkling song Open to find a way before all her dreams fade now. I feel that I must speak this truth. I do believe in you. All your life was dead for good, so misunderstood. from the end. Oh. Hi, Michelle Medrano. Aww. Mary Harris, lovely to have us have you with us. We've got Derek Wilder, Vicki Harvey, Saul Goodman. Aww. Thank you guys so much. Hope you have enjoyed the show. If you are in Arizona, we've mentioned a couple of the special Arizona shows that are happening the Musical Instrument Museum on May 11th, and then the Highland Center, the beautiful Highland Center, is on June 8th. And we're gonna be performing with our wonderful cellist, Laura Simmons, and 
on a wonderful harmonies. We're going to have Lane London. So we hope that you guys can come out for both of those shows. They'll be playing on the second set. Some of you have heard them in person, and they're just gorgeous. And they're actually going to be doing sunrise service, I believe, tomorrow uh, with Kelly and Corey. And so we wish them well with the Easter service. It's going to be beautiful, I'm sure. Uh, Jennifer Stanley, thank you so much for being with us, you guys. Kimberly Dawn. Aww. Margaret Curtis, wonderful. Okay, so this is a song called Hardest Good Days. And with all the loss of late, I feel like this is a really appropriate song. And it takes energy to find the goodness and to celebrate the goodness and the joy. And I have felt so much love this last week, especially with my birthday. And Laura put on a party for me and my e-bike girls. You did very well. Spoiled me. I did extraordinarily well. And I felt completely spoiled and loved. My sister came out from Rhode Island for nine days. And we did all the touristy things. So it was really sweet. Um, so thank you, everybody, for making me feel so special. So this is Hardest Good Days. Sea life sweet. 
there for a minute. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to sit here for a minute. Shall I hold your guitar? You should hold my guitar. Okay, I'm holding the guitar. I'm going somewhere. Rowan's got a little surprise, except I already know what it is. It's so cute. God, there's so many people I've been thinking of. In fact, Nick and Donna Dutton wrote from Greece today. Yes, how cute is that? Uh, just to wish me happy birthday, which was so thoughtful. Look at how cute you are, look at this. We've got champers, we've got um, Prosecco, we've got carrot cake, so lovely. So, so lovely. Thank you very, very much. Are you gonna have a little sip? I will, because it's right at the end. We and can't eat this right now. No. So that's it. That's it, we're gonna have to put it away because the cats will try to eat it. Boo-boo will, boo-boo, uh, is Roman's shadow. She's our Velcro kitty. Anything that Roman's eating or drinking, she thinks is perfect for little kitty. And she is taken to drinking coffee. We'll walk out of the room and there'll be a coffee cup on the table or something and she, we hear this. It is hysterical. <laughs> she eats your little danishes. She eats, she your eats my scone. Your I just like not. <laughs> No. Yeah, we're really sharing your healthy diet there. Scones. I know. Hey. Uh, scones, as they say. Scones. Mm -hmm. um, actually, that is from a place in Prescott. There is, there's a bakery here. They actually fly in all of the flour, the butter, all of this kind of stuff from Italy. So, 
sure. I can eat that. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? This is, this is from Trina. This is from Trina. My Ooh. beautiful, colorful shirt, um, little jacket that kind of matches is from Lisa. I love wearing it on my birthday. Isn't that beautiful? And it's perfect for the Mirabal sisters, the Mariposa. It's so perfect. I just love it. So I'm going to take a drink. I'm going to toast all of our beautiful March babies. And so grateful to know so many of you and to be able to share this time and space. So thank you so much. And if I drank, I'd have something eat uh, as well. But I will get myself a nice little gummy later. Thank you. A nice little gummy. A little gummy. <laughs> and uh, yes, I just want to thank so, so many people who... I know I've said it before, but they made my birthday so special. And uh, I know there's some lunches ahead as well, so it's not ending anytime soon. This is our song called Who. This has got to be for, for Dwindy and Angel. Yes, for Dwindy and, and for Angel, Dwindy, Dwindy and, and as well as the Stanleys, who have been in our hearts. And uh, yeah, we're holding you guys close. And Larry and Marty and so many, so many dear hearts.
also want to send out some prayers to Bernice, to Ben, and Heidi. We hope that you all are going to be doing better soon. Love you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you much. for joining us once again. Thank you, everybody, yeah. for your donations. You're helping to keep us going. You help to keep music alive. Um, and if not us, also other people. It's just, you know, if, if you don't support musicians, it'll go away. And the venues. Lots and of our venues. venues. A lot of venues when we were booking the tour, a lot of them are not doing... Yeah, a lot of them have shut down. They're shut down. They're not doing music. They're only doing... Um, and if they are doing music, they're just doing tribute bands. They're doing a lot of tribute bands. They're so, not doing original music, which so. is kind of a bummer. So we're really, really happy that we started this series, if you can believe it, four years ago. And because of you and people like you and sharing it and getting more awareness out there, we've been able to keep going in our music career. And we're so, so grateful. So thank you very, very much. And we look forward to reading your comments. And we will see you very soon. Okay, lots of thank love. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs>